It's a problem you may not even know exists until it's too late. The TSA searched for five hours to find a newlyweds diamond that had fallen off her engagement ring at the airport. She never knew it was loose. Apparently, this is a common problem that can be costly. Lena DeFlorius is live at Deutsche Fine Jewelry with more on that to try to help protect us. Hey there, Lena. Oh my goodness, can you imagine? You're so happy that you finally got your favorite bobble and then you look and say, oh my gosh, one of them is missing. So it has happened. You know, I actually took my ring into the jeweler and they said, you're actually about to lose a couple of these because of all of the soap and the hand sanitizer and the lotion getting in there. So it had me thinking, you know what? How often should we be checking our rings? So if you don't remember the last time you had your ring looked at or cleaned, trust me, it's time. So we do have Lance at Deutsche Fine Jewelers. Um, this, first of all, I'm mesmerized by the baubles. Give us um, an idea of how often should we be bringing our rings for you to take a look at and make sure everything's all good? Um, really, whenever, a lot of times whenever you feel something rough, you know, on the top of the stone, or if it starts to catch your clothes, you know, one of, one of the prongs might be coming loose. If, uh, you know, kind of feel the diamonds, they're kind of spinning and they're setting, you know, bring them in. Or just, if you're in the area, just stop by and, you know, we don't charge you to have your rings cleaned. And when we clean them, we check them and tell you if there's, if there's an issue with them or not. Yeah, and you so, have all kinds of neat tools. You're right. digging around in my ring, let me know, hey, you know what, things are looking good here and cleaning it makes all the difference so oh, how does. often should we be cleaning it and is that something we can do ourselves you know the, be the best way to clean a piece of jewelry is just get some lukewarm water and soap and a toothbrush because a toothbrush isn't going to hurt anything if your stone was going to fall out or it's loose it's going to come out anyway the toothbrush isn't going to knock it out mm -hmm. and the toothbrush cleans gets in between all the nicks and crannies like it does in your teeth so if you just get soap and water and just and just scrub it real hard and then um, you know r rinse it off and if you want it to dry real quick Gets all the gunk out. Yeah, it does. You can use, you use, use a blow dryer and just dry it real fast. Yeah. yeah. Beautiful. And you actually have these kits, yeah, too, we as kit, well. Yeah, we, we have these kits that we give to our customers that uh, have, um, let me see if I can get in here. They have a, a solvent rag to keep stuff clean. And what kind of like materials are we using that on? Gold, this you, can use, this you can use on anything. This you can use on your watches, on your diamonds. You can, you know, we, we, we have them in the store when we show them. After you put the ring on your finger, we well, we wipe it with the solvent because it gets all your fingerprints off. Uh -huh. So it makes it sound shiny. You know, then we have the, uh, the silver and gold polish. You know, where you put your pieces in here and, mm -hmm. and rub them and it cleans all that off. You'd be amazed how much gunk is on yeah, there. Yeah, it does. And yeah. then we have some jewelry cleaner. Okay, so and this is this is yeah, when we're so going this, a step beyond the, the right, soap and a toothbrush. Right, exactly. And then you, if if you come in here, we give these kits out to you know to all our customers. Uh -huh. And so it's just kind of something to take home and and, and uh, keep your stuff clean by. Okay. And then right. how often did you say? I'm sorry that we should you be know, cleaning. You it's, it's there's not really an, a, an often just kind of. It, the ring will tell you. you know, if you feel it rubbing, you know, ca catching your clothes, or if you feel a sharp or edge point on it, mm -hmm. you know, bring it in. Or, or, if it or, looks or if it's really, really dirty and you just want us to clean it, bring it in. We'll clean it while you wait, and then we can tell you if there's something wrong with it. Okay. Yeah. So let me tell you, cleaning makes all the difference because I thought my ring was not looking so great. It was looking a little bit shabby to me. You cleaned it up, and I said, "Woo! Now that's it. That's, that's a diamond." That's, and that's yeah. And it took what two minutes? <laughs> yeah. And yeah. so you're great enough to do that. Okay. Yeah. So Deutsche Fine Jewelers, you're in a Highland Village area. Yes, ma'am. And this is. The only location here in Houston. Yes, ma'am, sure is. Okay, so yeah. 90 years in the business, they know what they're talking about. They'll tell you if there's something going on with your ring. They'll also let you know, hey, it's time for maybe a little accessory to go with that beautiful rock of yours. I'll send it back to you. That is some helpful info right there, and it's been a while, so I got to go make an appointment. <laughs> Thanks for that reminder, Alita.